Hello, welcome back to my scrap room. My name is Jennifer Perry and I am an independent consultant with Close to My Heart. It's that time again. It is subscription Saturday. I love subscription Saturday. If you have your monthly box, I'm not sure if you've got it quite yet. If you don't, it should be on its way. If you have your four month box or your annual box, we are going to be working with Holly Jolly Days. Again, if you have your monthly box and you don't quite have your kit yet, you can always watch this video, come back later, and play with this again. Very, very easy. So, let's open up the kit. I'm going to take out the page protectors because I don't need them at the moment. I don't need them in my workspace. Take out the photo cards. And the very first thing, oh, these we got a lot of moving parts. Okay, so the first thing I want to do, and we figured this out on our very first layout when I got so confused, is Holly Dolly Days is layout one, and then Merry Christmas is layout two. So it is correct. The very first one that we did together in September, the, the layouts were backwards, and boy, did I get all messed up. So I'm just making a note for myself. Okay, so layout one and layout two. So set these aside for just a moment. These are the base pages. And I'm just gonna go ahead and set layout two aside. These are for layout one. And these are for layout one. So those can stay there. And then we need it appears to be four by six or three, I'm sorry, three by four, three by four, and three by four. Oh, there's my okay, I have it backwards. I bet you I have it backwards. I do. So that's gonna go there. Yep, I do. I have it backwards. So three by fours are gonna go on your second layout. And four by sixes is gonna go on layout one. Okay, so those can stay there. Now the other thing that I do to get ready is I'm going to separate my layout one and my layout two die cuts and stickers. This is something that I just do for myself. Just so I don't accidentally pick up the wrong sticker and put it on the wrong layout. Those go to layout two. These go to layout one. These go to layout one and these go to layout two. Okay, so we're not going to worry about those at the moment. they want this to go. They, this is page one and this is page two. I'm going to set page two aside. And this goes to page two. And two of these go to page two. So there's there. The very first thing we're going to do is we're going to take off these word stickers and put them down. And ordinarily I would go through and take out the die cuts, but these are white. I don't want to lose them. So we'll take them out just before I need them, okay? I may do this last because they're used on both sheets. All right. Whew. 
Who did that? Did they not realize I am naturally blonde? That could have been a disaster. That was much easier. Phew. So that's on side two, that's on side one. Okay, well, let's set that there for a second. Alrighty, so first thing we need is this sheet. And yes, it is skinnier than a four by six. There's a design on that. Those are Christmas trees. Okay, make sure your Christmas trees are going the direct, the correct direction. the other hearts oh right there okay so we need a big heart right there and then where's our little heart right there and I'm not gonna put the snowflakes on just yet we're gonna hold off on that so let's scoot this over. And let's do, 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 do like that. Like that, okay. Do I have my page on wrong? Oh, I do have my page on wrong. There we go. That's what it's supposed to be like. Again, make sure your trees are going the right direction. You can pick which direction you would like those to be. If you want upside down trees, put upside down trees. It is your layout. But I'm going to try for upright trees because it's a rarity for me. Then we've got four by six and four by six. Perfect. Okay. Yay. Alrighty, so now we are going to do, I'm going to take the sticky off most of the back of this sticker. So this is the anti-static powder that comes with embossing. You can also use regular baby powder and a dry paintbrush. This is just what I had on hand. So I'm going to cover where I want it to be sticky with my finger, and I'm just going to sticky. Now my paintbrush little thingies, my, my little 
fibers are getting on the back of this, I'm okay. It's not going to bother me. This is just a Swiffer cut in half to pick up any powder. I'm going to make pick off these little fibers that are hanging over the edge. And the rest of them can just stay there. I'm good. So this photo thingy is going to go, this photo thingy, this sticker is going to go right there. And as you can see, I can still get my photo underneath. So then we have this. It's going to go right there. There's a large heart on this one. And a small heart. Goes there. Okay, so that's it for the main components. Now what I'm going to do is set these side by side. And work on taking these out and plunking them down. And I'm probably going to speed this up a little bit because there is a bunch of negative space I need to clear out. So I'm just going to be quiet for a few minutes. I'm going to speed this up so you can you know what I'm doing. You can watch what I'm doing and you can see what you need to be doing. Okay, so let's get these plugged down. This is one of those just get the adhesive where you can get the adhesive. Um, and it will be okay. over a little bit so you can see what I'm doing.
So this is layout one, side one, and side two. Move over to page two. Okay, so these are exactly the same, so I'm going to set one aside, and I've got one photo there and two photos here. Okay, so the first one is going to be this guy. Well, first let's put the Merry, Merry Memories on. So we've got a guideline of where we need to go. So Merry Memories. I'm not going to stick it down totally just yet because I want to make sure I get this one where it needs to be. Negative space. Is it that O? Oh, I got it. I was trying to get that itty bitty one out, and I got it. Okay. Okay, so there's our guideline. So the first one that we need is to get this out from underneath my fingernail before it drives me crazy. There we go. This. This guy. And 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 it's a sticker, so. Alright, there's one thing that I want to do that is not part of the kit, but I want to add it. And I may add it to two or three of them, so I'm going to keep this out. This is just the golden white twine. So I have one, two, three, four, five. So, okay. I'm taking off quite a bit because I tend to cut things really short. So I'm going to take and just punch a hole. Again, this is not something you have to do. It just me adds a little bit extra to the layout. Okay, and I'm going to cut. And I've got another one over here, but I'll do him in just a moment. So we are going to... One's going to be angled. This one's going to be straight. This is going to be angled a tiny bit. Well, I guess it's going to be angled like that because that's where that's where it went down. And then this guy. Mm. 
Now, if you do not want to do this step, you do not have to do this step. This is just something I'm doing with my personal layout because it makes me happy. And then there is a little bitty tag. I'm not going to do it with this one because the hole would be bigger than the tag. But I am going to poke it. See, if I was to try and put the hole in that one, that's bigger than the tag. I'm going to de sticky this one just on one side. Okay, so this one is almost done. is going to go. Believe it or not, that's what they wanted right there. It might go up a little farther. Put that one there. Okay. So this is side one. Let's scooch over and do side two. Alrighty, so for this one we need to take everything out. Oh, there's a snowflake that goes on side one. better. So we've got a bow. So that guy goes, that does not go there. This guy goes here. This guy goes here, this guy goes here, candy cane, and tags. Okay, so we're going to I'm going to add some thread to this one because I want to. Again, you don't have to. I want to. I know I use an obnoxious amount of thread, but it makes me happy.
Okay. So now we've got this guy. It's a little bit harder to put it on the stickered sheets, but it works. So this guy goes here. And then this guy. This guy goes here. Ouch. And they have a little Christmas tree right here. And these crazy little abstract trees are next to it. And last but not least is our little bow. Okay. So this is layout two. Take my eyeballs off. Layout two, page one. And layout two, page two. Let's put them side by side. I like it. So layout one, page one. Layout two, page two. Layout 2, page 1, and Layout 2, page 2. Thank you so much for spending your Saturday morning with me. I know there's 101 things you could be doing otherwise. I really appreciate it, and I feel very blessed that you're here. Until next time, thank you so much again. Bye-bye.